Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're asked to solve each equation for x. So we have these two equations here, and we're gonna use the fact that we have a relationship between exponentials and logarithms, where if we had e to the x equals y, this means that log base e of y equals x. So we're moving these variables around to be able to solve the equation in one way or another. And of course, it doesn't have to be e, it can be any base. Here, we have e to the 7 minus 4x equals 6. Therefore, we can take log base e, right? The base of the log and the base of the exponent exponential function are the same. Log base e of the other side is 6 is equal to the exponent 7 minus 4x. Log base e is ln, the natural log, of 6 equals 7 minus 4x. And now we just have to solve for x. Subtract 7 from both sides. This cancels. ln of 6 minus 7 equals negative 4x. Divide by negative 4. These cancel, and we're left with just x is equal to negative, I'll move the negative out front, ln of 6 minus 7 over 4. In b, we have the natural log of 3x minus 10 is equal to 2. The natural log is log base e of 3x minus 10 is equal to 2. Therefore, doing this, we have e to the x, e squared, equals y, 3x minus 10, right? Using the same property, we get e squared, e squared equals 3x minus 10. We can add 10 to both sides. This cancels, and we're left with 3x equals e squared plus 10. Dividing by 3 to get x on its own. This cancels, and we're left with x is equal to e squared plus 10 over 3. So the solution to a is negative, ln of 6 minus 7 over 4. And the solution for b is e squared plus 10 over 3.